morning everyone today it's a beautiful day here in lisbon finally it has stopped raining and the sun is out and we are super excited to start exploring this lovely city so today the plan is we're going to sintra and we're gonna see some castles there and uh, sintra is a 40 minute train ride from lisbon yeah so let's go check it out tuk-tuks uh, which charges about five to seven euros per person and right now we are in like a small tram which charges eight euros per person which is a nice ride it is for two eleven thirty So 14, like a card, like that. Tickets done. Let's go. Vena Palace in Sintra is a red and yellow fairy tale castle located at the highest point overlooking the entire region. It was once designed in 1854 by the king who released all of his creative imagination in his castle and parked to become his summer house. And uh, we are actually touring the palace, the rooms and everything in the palace and it's just amazing. We were outside for like 10-15 minutes 
and the views are probably the best we have ever seen. And still we have more to go. So we are at the Penak castle. This castle is absolutely beautiful. It's all so colorful and vibrant. It's all red, yellows, and a lot of tiles in there. Beautiful castle. And uh, we also got to go inside. So the ticket price for this castle is 14 euros per person, which gives you access to the, all the terraces, like where you can see everything. And then even to the inside, which is again, incredible. And this pa it, sorry, and this castle sits in a park and this is the highest point so it overlooks the whole park and I don't know the if that's... The whole region basically. Yeah, whole region. I, that might be... Sin so I, I don't know if it's Sintra or it's Lisbon but it no, overlooks... No, not Lisbon, it's Sintra. Lisbon is almost 40 kilometers away from here. Okay, so yeah, so. But this is absolutely gorgeous. Yes. This is all right. in town now and uh, now we're gonna visit another castle uh, it's named as Castello de Sao Jorge uh, I don't know if I pronounced it properly or not and uh, the castle gives you 360 degree views of the full city and uh, we're gonna go and check out the sunset views from the top Right now we are at our second castle of the day and this castle as I mentioned earlier is in Lisbon and the best part is this is just 10 minutes walk from where we are staying. This castle is just spectacular. The city views you get from here are just out of the world. Just looking at those old architectural houses is amazing. And the bonus point is there are so many peacocks in the castle which is amazing i have not seen peacock in a very very long time so i got really excited so right now we are sitting and enjoying the sunset overlooking this beautiful city it's hard to believe that this city was actually destroyed in the late 1700s and rebuilt. So it just looks absolutely incredible. And another fun fact about Lisbon is that it's also called City of Seven Hills. So that's why it offers a lot many different viewpoints and the castle, this castle is one of them. <laughs> the entry fee to this palace is 11 euros per person. 14 euros per person. <laughs> oh, really? Okay. 
Hold on, again. So we are right now at Pena Palace. Shabnam is very focused on capturing this. 